Hi everyone, today we're diving into Plasticity versus Fusion 360, two powerful CAD tools. We'll break down what each one does, compare them, and figure out which one is best for what. Let's go. First up, we have Plasticity. It's a lightweight polygon-based CAD tool focused on hard surface modeling. Thanks sleek designs for games, animation, or 3D printing. Its non-destructive workflow uses modifiers, making it super intuitive for artists. Plasticity shines in speed and simplicity with a one-time purchase price of around $150. It's great for solo creators or small teams, but lacks advanced simulation or CAM features. Now, Fusion 360 by Autodesk. This is a cloud-based parametric CAD platform for engineers and designers. It handles everything, 3D modeling, assembly, simulations, rendering, and even CNC machining. With a subscription starting at $545 a year, it's feature-packed but complex. Fusion 360 is ideal for product development and manufacturing but can feel overkill for simple creative tasks. So, how do they stack up? Plasticity is faster for artistic, polygon-based designs, perfect for 3D printing or game assets. Fusion 360 dominates for engineering with parametric modeling, simulations, and CAM for production. Plasticity is cheaper and simpler while Fusion is robust but pricier and steeper to learn. If you're an artist, go Plasticity. For engineering or manufacturing, Fusion 360 is your pick. That's the rundown, guys. Check the chart below for a quick recap and which tools your vibe. Let us know in the comments below, smash that like button, and subscribe for more tech breakdowns. See ya.